Hey guys, I am with the uh, FMS FCX24 today. I want to show you some scale Enjora upgrades that I got. Uh, but first, let me show you the RC. I got some uh, the same style rims and tires that I had previously on this, if you watched my other video. But I got them in gray, and it's right on point with the same color as the RC. It matches so nice, and I think it looks very good, very scale. Uh, I love these um, Enjora All-Terrain AT tires. Now, they have the MT tires, which I'm assuming it's Monster Truck. And, of course, the AT is All-Terrain. So, um, but I, I, these are siped. Uh, both of them are siped, but I think I like these a little bit better um, for rock crawling and stuff. Uh, they just do great. I love the look of them. But I also do like the MTs. But um, I will include a link to Enjora's website. That's where I buy everything Enjora for any of my RCs. Uh, it's a great website. It does come from China, so it takes you got to give it a little bit of time to get here. It took about a month or so. If you look at, uh, at the time of my last video, I, I ordered those about the day of that video, all this stuff. And it took about that long to get here, which is about a month or so. Um, but also, I got a really cool net that is made for this this is all made for this rc really cool little boxes that say enjora on them you got a cool shovel a cool little barrel all this stuff will fit on top and you can but the only reason i didn't i didn't want to make it any more top heavy this stuff isn't heavy at all really but um i'm still going to do some testing with it i might just save this stuff for my uh six by six rc but also got some sand ladders but these look more like for a, um, a 24 scale they're really small really cool i mean they, they would work for this but they seem a little bit smaller than your normal sand ladder but uh, maybe they make smaller ones too i mean in, in in real scale scale world but um anyway i wanted to show you some of these little upgrades you can get on their their website really cool stuff very detailed um i do have a gas can that has a mount for it and also a little fire extinguisher and they're tiny i mean i'm used to the 10 scale stuff this stuff is really tiny. I didn't bring it out because I don't want to lose the screws and the mounting hardware. But um, I'm going to go ahead and give this thing a spin. Oh, yeah, look at my D-rings I got. These came from Enjora also. I love these things. They look so good. They're tiny. The smallest D metal aluminum D-rings I have. Um, I do have a couple sets of D-rings that's this small, but they're all plastic. This is the first time I got aluminum ones. Um, and I really think they, they added to it. You can get black. But I opted for the red ones because uh, traditionally I see a lot of red ones in, in the real world. So I just wanted to go with red. But uh, we're going to give this thing another spin in the woods. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please hit that like button. If you have any questions, just hit me up in the comment section. And uh, let's get to rolling, guys. Fumble.
Everything's so wet out here, guys. Keep that in mind. It's been pouring down rain all morning. This thing still made it over it. All right, guys, tell me what you think on uh, the looks and the performance of this thing. It's pretty amazing. Um, a lot of this thing is driving over stuff that, I, you know, I use my tent scale RCs for, um, and I haven't altered any of these logs at all for it. Uh, you did notice it was slipping a little bit on that, that one pile. It's literally, this stuff is like, it's slick. It's really wet. And when you know what it's like when wood gets, gets soaking wet, it's just slicker and I don't know what. Um, but... It still performed great and it got over everything and i just love this thing it's became my favorite um smaller scale uh trail truck uh a great crawler you know um but i usually use this mainly for for uh trailing and i love i absolutely love these tires on the thing it makes it look more scale um because the thing sits up so high out the box the original wheels are, are right here. They look like this, and they did do a good job. They made these these tires softer, uh, softer compound than uh, what they had before, and uh, which is nice. But they're just so small. It didn't look right to me. It was jacked up real high with smaller tires, and it left a lot of space right here in between the the tire well and the tire itself. Um, so these tires, I think, just look so good and fit it just right when i had the white ones on here it made me want black or gray i just really wanted to see what that would look like and uh, let me know your thoughts on these uh these gray these silver ones here or gunmetal gray whatever you want to call it uh they do match the body almost identical i mean it looks great i think um almost the exact same shade and everything but uh it, it just it, this thing just operates so good it was worth putting the uh the small the upgrades to it um, but just to a change in these tires made this thing just unbelievable and you see it didn't tip over at all on me I mean this thing uh, being it's a little top heavy with it does have if you notice it's got a wide stance and That it definitely helps it, but these tires are also help it a whole lot. I believe But uh, let me know your thoughts in, in the comments and also I want to share this with you um, If you get one of these if you change the number one switch right there if you see it's, it's up instead of down like the others if you Turn that up and then turn everything on. Your RC will have instant instant reverse. Uh, it comes stock without instant reverse. And uh, if you know anything about crawling, you definitely want instant reverse on that. Even with some of the trailing that I do and the crawling I do in between my trailing, I, I want instant reverse. And that was just awesome that I can change it on the fly right there. Uh, just just a little side note. If you guys get one of these, you, you definitely want to think about uh, changing that number one switch to instant reverse. But um, anyway, if you guys have any questions or comments, just hit me up in the comment section. And if you like that video, please hit that like button. It, it helps my channel greatly. I, I really, really appreciate it. And the thing about subscribing to my channel, I have hundreds of videos. Um, and all my videos, I just show the true, actual RC just driving. You, you For what you pay for, you, what you see is what you get. I don't cut it or anything. If I wreck, I wreck. If the thing breaks, it breaks. Um, I just hope you guys enjoy the, the videos. And just keep watching. And as always, guys, 
Thanks for everything.